What is up guys? I'm Daddy Gamer Fred and welcome back to another Pokemon Sword and Shield news update video. Today, we got a brand new Pokemon Sword and Shield Owl of Armor DLC trailer. I just did my trailer reaction review. Obviously, there is going to be a ton of news following that's breaking with everything new in the trailer. I was working on that video and then I stumbled across this news and I figured that this news kind of deserved its own video. And that's what we're doing now is the video for this brand new event that starts today inside a Pokemon Sword and Shield. I'm going to be doing it live in this video for you guys so you guys could follow the steps and redeem these Pokemon for yourself. This is coming from the official Pokemon website. Let's jump over and check out what I'm talking about. And that is that you are able to pick up a Grookey, a Score Bunny, and a Snobble with its hidden ability inside a Pokemon home. Now, I believe this is the first time these hidden abilities are appearing in game, making this the very first appearance of these of these starters with this hidden ability. This is a new, usually every generation with Pokemon on bank we got in the hidden abilities dropped on in bank that you got to pick it up that usually happens around like a year after the game's release so this is kind of early and this is kind of cool getting us hype for that dlc i think this is like perfect timing to release the starters with its hidden ability let's go over them real quickly Grookey with its hidden ability, Grassy Surge. Grookey's hidden ability, Grassy Surge, is a rare ability that normally wouldn't be available. It was impossible to attain a Grookey with this ability until now. Grookey comes with, again, level 5 with the ability Grassy Surge with the moves Scratch and Growl. Moving on to Score Bunny with his hidden ability, Libero. Score Bunny hidden ability is Libero. It's a rare ability that makes its first appearance in Pokemon Sword and Shield. It was impossible to attain the Score Bunny with this hidden ability until now. Again, a brand new hidden ability. They are stating for this brand new score bunny. And it again, comes at level 5 with the hidden ability. And it's going to have the moves Tackle and Growl. And then last but not least, Snobble with his hidden ability Sniper. Snobble's hidden ability is Sniper. It's a rare ability that normally wouldn't be available. And it's impossible to attain a Snobble with this hidden ability until now. Level 5 Sniper is the ability and the moves are going to be pound and ground. Okay, jumping into how to receive them. It says starting Tuesday, June 2nd, 2020, you'll be able to transfer one or more Pokemon from Pokemon Sword and Shield to the Nintendo Switch version of Pokemon Home. You'll be able to receive Grookey, Score Bunny, and Snobble with its hidden ability and gifts in the mobile device version of Pokemon Home. So basically what you have to do is transfer one Pokemon from Sword and Shield into Home. It's going to register that you did that. Once you do that, you're going to get the mystery gifts for these hidden ability starters inside of your Pokemon Home. With, then you could probably move them over to Sword and Shield and then do whatever you want with them. It says to receive the items after the release of Owl of Armor. It says in the mobile device version of Pokemon Home, tap the home screen button at the bottom left of the screen, select mystery gifts, select gift box, select which gift in your gift box you would like to claim, then select receive and the Pokemon will deposit in your Pokemon home boxes. Note, in order to receive the Pokemon, you will need to link the Nintendo Switch version of Pokemon Home and Pokemon Home mobile device version to the same Nintendo account. Basically, the account has to be linked up to the Nintendo Switch and your mobile phone in order for the gift to obviously be received on the Switch version of the game. And then it has the steps shown in image form where it shows the news icon with a new tab you click on that you go mystery gift you go to your gift box and you're gonna have the three starters with its hidden ability it says take your grookey score bunny and snobble to pokemon sword and shields it says start up the nintendo switch version of pokemon home and select pokemon from the main menu and then select the game you want to connect to as well as which user save data you want to access select the pokemon you want to move from pokemon home into a link game and the boxes they will be moved to make sure you press the plus button after completing the move to save your changes before quitting it says no you will only be able to receive the gift once per pokemon home account even 
if you own multiple copies of Pokemon Sword or Pokemon Shield games. Unfortunately, if you have Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield, you cannot double up on these gifts because, again, they are linked particularly to your Pokemon Home account and you only get one gift per account. Well, you get three gifts technically because you get all three starters, which is amazing. Again, for someone that may have not gotten the starters, this is a perfect way to get your own fresh starters. And hey, yeah, it's going to have its hidden ability. I think this is pretty cool. Let me go and start up and actually claim these for myself and actually bring them over into Pokemon Sword and Shield so I can show you guys how to actually do these steps for real and not just read it off of the damn Pokemon website. So again, I'm going to check because I started the Pokemon, I already transferred a Pokemon into Pokemon Home before. I'm going to see if I need to do it now, basically, do I need to do it again? So I'm going to go to Pokemon Home. Let's start this up. Pow. News. Now let's see. Shiny Rock Razor. That's not what we're here for. We're going to go to Mystery Gifts. And then I'm going to go to Gift Box. And, oh, I got a Rotom. Let's claim that. Let's claim that Rotom. Would you like to give Rotom a nickname? No. We could take it, though. All right. So, yes, you will have to transfer over a brand new Pokemon from Pokemon Sword and Shield into your game so let's do that let me log off completely from pokemon home and let me with my controller let's go into pokemon home where are you so we got pokemon home loaded up let's jump in so now that we have pokemon home started up let's move a pokemon from pokemon sword into home yes i want to connect to these games Let's do that. Let's go. Let's move over. Hmm, who do we want to move over? That's. Uh, it doesn't really matter, right? Let's um. Move over. Is this the Ponyta inside of the? Yeah, the brand new Ponyta from the event. Let's move that over. And because I moved it over into Pokemon Home, that should be the only thing I needed to do. So let's hit the plus button. It says, would you like to save and exit? Yes, let's save and exit. Okay. And now that we saved and exit, we log off of Pokemon Home on the Nintendo Switch. Jump back on the phone version of the app. Okay, now we in the phone version of the app. Let's go to Mystery Gifts. Let's go to Gift Box. Wow, there we go. We got Gift for connecting to Galar 1, 2, and 3. 1 is Grookey. Let's claim Grookey. No, I don't want to give it a nickname. The same thing with Galar 2. We could collect that. That is Score Bunny. No, I don't want to give it a nickname. And the same thing with Galar 3. Again, just for connecting to Pokemon Sword or Pokemon Shield. Me was Pokemon Shield. So, Bow, we got those. Now that we connected, we could jump back into Pokemon Home on the Nintendo Switch app. Okay, now Pokemon, um, Pokemon Home. Yes, I would love to check the boxes. Yep, here it is. This is box one with my Rotom that I just got, my Grookey that I just got with its hitting ability, the Score Bunny, and it's the Snobble. Sadly, they're not in the Cherish Ball. But again, they are here in Ability, Grassley, Surge, as you can see on the bottom. You got Libro, and then you got Sniper. Pretty cool. Pretty cool, again, that these Hidden Ability starters are finally here inside of Pokemon Sword and Shield. You can get them today. I just walked through the steps. I have them. And again, only thing you have to do now to bring them into Sword and Shield is with Home, actually bring them over. And I did a video on that. It's pretty easy to do that. All you need to do is, again, connect your Sword and Shield game to Pokemon Home and then pick them up from this box, the Pokemon Home box, and drop them into Pokemon Sword and Shield. So let me know in the comment section below your thoughts of the starters being released with its 
hitting ability. Let me know your thoughts on that in the comment section below. As you guys know, I answer all comments, so let's have that conversation down there. If you have any more questions about how to do this again, let's have that conversation. I'm willing to help anybody out if they need it. If you enjoyed the video or found this helpful, please leave a like. It does help me out a ton as far as moving the video and to recommend it so other people can check out the video. If you're new around here, I do videos like this every day covering Pokemon news and especially with the DLC coming out, I'm gonna be doing a ton of videos ton of tutorials as well on the brand new content so if you want to stick around for that please hit that subscribe button i also do tons of other videos about warzone and fortnite and stuff like that just games basically that i'm playing and that i'm into you're gonna catch those as well on the channel peace i love you i'm gonna see you guys on the next one thank you thank you thank you for making it to the end of this video if you're not a subscriber and you made it this far hit that subscribe button you know you want to join the family ring the bell so you can be no notified on the next time I drop one of my videos as well as hit the like button on this video so it could be recommended so more people can check it out so we can have more people join in the family if you want to keep up with me on other social media platforms such as Twitter Instagram or TikTok or whatever I'm daddy gamer Fred on all of those again daddy gamer Fred you'll be able to find all those links in the description of this video and the pin tweet comment on my Twitter also on all of my videos I do answer all comments so again if you just want to chat it up about the video or anything just hit me up in the comment section below I take time out of my day and literally answer to all the comments that you guys leave me and I love it and again let's have that conversation down there here are a couple of suggested videos that you guys should check out that may be of your interest I am a variety channel I do tons of stuff tons of Pokemon but tons of other stuff as well so dive into these videos peace i love you guys i'm gonna see you guys on the next one